The following story has been brought to you by storiestoinspire.org. I want to tell you a mighty good story that I heard from Rabshneya Kotla. At the end of World War II, one of the Rabbanim from Chicago was asked to go and fl- uh, to go to Europe to help out in the matzav of the DP camps after the war. And he was Moskim, and he went to, to Europe, and he, he did what he had to. At the end of the time that he was supposed to be there, he took a plane ride back, and unfortunately they got a message from the airline company that the plane crashed, and everybody is on the bottom of the ocean. And the people, the family of this Rav, wanted a Sitchev already. So they called, they called up Rabar and Kotla, and Rabbi Aaron Kotler told him, absolutely not sitting Shiva. So they asked him, why not? What, what are we waiting for? So he says, what do you mean? The Gemara says, Shluchei mitzvah einam nizoykim loibali chosim v'loi v'chazi rosam. Not on the way there, not on the way back. I sent him for Dvar Mitzvah, he's coming back. V'kachava, three days later, this guy, Bo Horik Baraglov, he came back, the guy is here, everything's fine, he's alive. And he comes and he calls up Rabbi Aaron Kotler. Rabbi Shnei is saying this over. Then he called his father, Rabbi Aaron Kotler, and he tells him that Baruch Hashem is back, all right? He says, a few things happened the last minute. I wasn't able to make the plane. I came a few minutes late to the plane. They didn't let me on the airplane already. So I had to wait two days later for another airplane. And now I'm back. And the taka, the plane taka crashed. But this year it was not on the plane. Shluchim mitzah, eden nezekim, loi bali chasim, loi b'chazi rasim. Enjoyed this story? Come again. Bring a friend. Stories to inspire.org.